Hello, thank you for joining us today, and welcome to our colleagues and friends joining us and watching us from Barcelona, London, or anywhere else in the world. So let me introduce you to our speakers today, Mr. Clemens Bloom, Executive Vice President, Industry. Yeah, greetings to everybody. Uh, my task for the next minute is uh, uh, just to recap you uh, on, uh, on the uh, Schneider Electric strategy is uh, what is our mission, what are the uh, macroeconomic forces behind, uh, and how we see uh, the future in energy and automation, uh, and all the innovation we are driving around. So I just give you a review on this, and then the colleagues here to my right, they will then focus on uh, very specific details around uh, connectivity and augmented operator as a particular subject uh, for the innovation round for today. Okay, so let's start and move on. So um, uh, I like to uh, really like to talk about this this uh, uh, because I think this shows in a very few simple numbers what's going on on this planet around uh, the global warming. Uh, what is the, the increase in energy consumption as a result? Uh, what does it mean for us and what we as uh, technicians? I think can contribute in order to uh, reduce the risk for the environment and reduce the global warming. The, the equation is pretty, pretty simple. The energy consumption will grow by more than 50% uh, over the next, next years. And, uh, and uh, th this is driven by uh, ever increasing demand of energy. Second macro uh, trend is uh, the urban, massive urbanization. Digitization, we all like our digital uh, smartphones, but this is really driving uh, electricity and energy consumption. Uh, and this is really the reason why, why uh, the uh, energy consumption is, is, is so far increasing. And then this, on the other side, we have to reduce the carbon footprint. And when we look at the uh, uh, Kyoto Protocol uh, a few years ago, the, the carbon footprint has to be reduced by factor two. So it's a simple equation, 1.5 times 2 is 3. So in other words, we have to become three times more efficient uh, on this planet in order to avoid severe damage, irrecoverable damage uh, on the environment. And I think we as automation people, we as energy providing people, we have um, here a lot to play, an important role to play in order to make this happen that we can uh, be much, for, much more efficient in, in, in the future. On the other side, and uh, this is one of our core beliefs in Schneider Electric, uh, we believe the access to el electricity is a human right. The access to electricity is a human right. Because access to electricity means access to information. Access to information means access to education. And access to education means a better life. This is why we believe that electricity is a basic human right. But the energy consumption uh, will increase by 80% in the next 25 years. The electricity consumption will increase uh, in, in the next years dramatically. And when you look is, is, and this is also a very simple equation, for one energy unit, electricity, usually three energy units of fossil energy are consumed in order to generate one unit of uh, electricity. So if we can make the whole use, the whole consume on end users and consumers of electricity far more efficient, what I say is one kilowatt saved at the end user side saves three kilowatt equivalent energy on the generation side. And this is the mission behind what we do at Schneider Electric. So then the second mega trend is the future will be far more connected. 50 billion devices by 2020. Nobody has doubts on this. When we see how the numbers of smart devices is exponentially increasing, uh, this will be a different gameplay in the future. Energy will be far more distributed. Renewable energy is taking its place. Photovoltaic, photo energy uh, is, is growing immensely. In 2014, the global investment into renewable energies uh, bypassed the in investment in conventional energies, 2015. So what is the consequence is that these renewables are far more uh, uh, distributed. 
uh, far more local, far more decentralized, and this needs to be connected in order to be efficiently managed. And here, I think, this is the equation. More electricity, more connectivity, more distribution of energy, and this will drive then, together with software and uh, different applications, far more efficiency. And we believe that uh, two-thirds untapped uh, efficiency potential. As I said before, when you, again, I repeat, one kilowatt saved at the end user side, three kilowatts saved at the generation side. And this is what we drive. Now, we as Schneider Electric, <clears throat> we combine energy management, automation, and software uh, by serving four markets. And those four key markets, this is a residential area, this is commercial building area, this is industry and infrastructure and data center. These are the core markets we are serving. And those core markets are consuming up to 70% of the global energy. So with our focus, we are right, let's say, in the core, in the focus of the core of the problem. Uh, and we strongly believe by the combination of energy, automation, software, putting analytics on top of this, this can make the difference and this will make the difference. When you then uh, look at this and say, uh, okay, on top, uh, you bring then the connectivity layer. So that information of the energy consumption, the information around automation of processes is in real time available, then you really can start uh, to drive uh, more efficiency because you are then far more predictable. You look ahead, uh, you do predictive modeling, and you understand perfectly well what your process is doing in, under certain load conditions. And this is what automation people and software people can do. And this is what we focus on. And by this, you are really in charge, or really, it's really possible to optimize the energy consumption as well as to optimize the process who are consuming the energy, and vice versa. So this is, let's say, the driving force behind. So nevertheless, uh, when we look based on our mission and around innovation, our focus since the 60s has been that we make energy and electricity safe. That's the fundamental of all what we do. Then, in the next step, we started to make the energy far more reliable. So we are the leader, for instance, in uninterrupted power supplies, APC, well-known brand. Based on this, we then started to uh, drive for more efficiency. So we have globally in, in uh, uh, global installations of, in plants, in utilities, in food and bath companies, you name it. We have our automation and energy solutions to make this, this place far more efficient. On top of this, we drive uh, sustainability. And we bring new innovations into the market around uh, solar energy uh, connection to the grid, solar energy storage systems, which is another level of bringing sustainability and efficiency in, into the environment. And then the whole subject around connectivity. We should not forget in, uh, it was in 1997, I still remember 1997, we put uh, open Ethernet IP technologies onto every new PLC. We called it Transparent Ready. We created the Transparent Factory by making the factory digital and connecting the enterprise. We created Transparent Factory. And at that time, uh, uh, we got the reward, the Smithsonian Award, for the being most innovative in this area. And in this reward speech, it was said that Schneider Electric creates the transparency from sensor to CEO. That's now 19 years ago. In these years, we all talk about IoT, the Internet of Things, the industrial Internet of Things. Uh, I think uh, we, we are the forefathers. We have been inventing this already close to 20 years ago with Transparent Ready and Transparent Factory. And this is, is shows exactly in this term what uh, connectivity, software, and analytics brings, uh, can bring to a manufacturing operation, to a refining, uh, to a utility in terms of efficiency, 
in order again to reduce uh, the energy consumption. Now, um, what does this mean all mean? Is uh, when you look, we have placed ourselves in the last uh, 20 years in all major markets. Uh, with our innovations, we are very much present in, uh, in the largest oil and gas uh, companies. We are covering more than 100 wastewater, wastewater plants. We are playing with our solutions in the top 10 major uh, global electric utilities. These are where we are present. This is where we have established ourselves with our innovations around energy management,